Hi everyone and welcome to Vlogmas Day 3, November 27th. It's Black Friday. Man, this is a different Black Friday than usual. Usually I'd be doing my shopping on it, like the mall and all the, the big stores. Not really into that this year. I just didn't see enough deals really worth it for me. And I don't really feel like getting in a bunch of crowds. And really the main determinant here I have a lot of work to do today, so I just did not have really a lot of time to go running around to all the department stores and all that this year. Anyway, just wasn't wasn't stacking up as something I could do this year. Um, I have a lot of work to do today, actually. I have three different videos I have to work on. Um, I vlog this all the one you're watching now, worked on this all day. Um, I love doing the vlogs. I have my Kroger video, which unfortunately I really hate that Kroger I understand it, I guess, but I wish they just would have rode their other sale out until Tuesday because we have this new five-day ad that started today, and it just is a mess, honestly. I always hate it when there's a holiday week. It'll happen this way at Christmas, too, because it's just the way Kroger changes their sales up is that they don't start a sale right, like the day before a holiday. They wait till the day after. So that's why my videos are a little all over the place. So what I'm doing now is I'm going through, I'm starting with Kroger, getting my list together for Kroger. I'm going to go there first, film and pick up the few I bought of things I want to do there. Um, come home, edit all that and upload it so you guys get it early. Then uh, it might be even be lunchtime by then. I don't know how long this is going to take. But then I'm going to head on over to... I am going to go back to CBS Because I noticed I had a new CRT pop-up for a free Cliff Bar. Of course, I'm going to do that. Um, I have a Hallmark deal with a CRT that I have. And then I saw Savvy Coupon Shopper posted that there are CVS brand um, panty liners. $1.19 giving $1.19 extra care buck. So that's going to be a quick all digital transaction. I'm just going to send my ECB to the card, all my CRTs to the card. It's going to be an awesome time at CBS. Then I'm going to, of course, go down to Rite Aid. I'm going to film all this today, too. I'm just giving you a summary. I'm going to go to Rite Aid, load up at Rite Aid. I'm super pumped about that. Um, and then I'm going to go, I don't know when, because I don't, I don't even know how Walmart's going to be today. If it's super packed, I will wait until tonight and head over. If it's not super busy this afternoon, I'll just go. But we'll see, because um, I want a coupon at Walmart, too. There's a lot of deals I really want to do there. But um, I don't want to get any crazy crowds today. So, yeah, it's kind of a rundown of my day. I'm just going to keep on plugging with work. I got to get the Kroger list together and all the overlays. I got to do those, and then I got to go and, go and start filming. So, yeah, that is what I'm doing. That's kind of a rundown. I'm going to let you guys... Oh, I have a paper to write, too, today. Man, it's going to be a busy day. I'm going to let you guys follow me along all along the day. So let's just get started. All right, so I'm in Kroger now filming my breakdowns video. It's really not busy here at all. I didn't expect it to be. Um, but yeah, so that's what's going on now. And I'm going to get my couponing into. I just ran into one of um, my subscribers here at Kroger. It's always so cool to run into you guys. I feel like almost every time I come now, somebody recognizes me. It's really cool. So... I say it every time. If you ever see me in the store, feel free to just come up and say hi. I always like getting to meet you guys. It's so cool. So, yes. Awesome. All right. So, this is all I got um, at Kroger. Pretty awesome. All the breakdowns will be in my um, video that's already been posted by this morning. So, go watch that for the breakdowns. Does anybody else hate when you get in the car and you got to wait for your heater to warm up and it's blowing out like crazy cold air? It's like miserable. Huh hate it so now i'm done in kroger I, I was bummed they didn't have the one big money maker the um big dokalax money maker i'm not shocked they were wiped on it it would have ended up making me like 450 before tax so they're out but I'm just, it's okay i'm gonna look at walmart I, I bet they have it at walmart that's where i'm probably gonna get it it'll be less of a money maker but still a money maker so it's all good and those coupons are about to expire so i want to get i want to get it on it wherever i can get it so i'm gonna submit my rebates now Always, always, always submit your rebates as soon as you get done. So that's what I'm going to do now. And um, then I'm going to head home and edit and upload my Kroger video and get the rest of my list together for Walmart. Uh, I don't know. Right in, I feel like I'm just going to wing it. So we'll see. But yeah, that's what I'm going to do now. All right. So now I am um, finishing up editing my video. You guys will have seen it by now. I'm going to upload that to YouTube and then I'm going to work on my haul list. So I did four rebates at Walmart. I need four more 
or I'm sorry, four at Kroger. I need four more at Walmart to knock out this bonus for $3 on eight. And I'm super, super excited to get in on some Walmart deals, but amazing. So I'm gonna upload this and keep working on my shopping. Yes. All right, so CVS round two. Um, just a couple things. Or it's actually, what round are we up to now? I did four transactions yesterday, so I guess this is round five. Um, getting the Hallmark card moneymaker that I talked about earlier. Um, go and find the cliff bars and the um, little pack of liners. Should be a nice little moneymaker. A little tiny moneymaker, but a moneymaker nonetheless. All right, so I'll grab my unadvertised freebie on the um, CVS liners. I actually swapped it out for the bigger pack. Someone saw me um, looking at panty liners and I think they think I'm legit crazy. <laughs> Whatever. And I got my free Cliff protein bar. So that is my CVS couponing. All right, so done with CVS and it actually went even better than expected because I was able to find um, the Alka-Seltzer gum. I've been looking for that since the beginning of the week and I didn't even have it yesterday. Maybe they just got a truck or something today, but um, so I'll explain what I did. I got these three Hallmark cards. These are two bucks each. I had a four off three digital that did work just fine. Like I said, I was confused because it said two ninety nine or more. So I, I guess maybe it just meant that the minimum had to be two ninety nine for the three cards, meaning you couldn't get three of the ninety nine cent ones. I, I don't know, but it worked just fine. So, anyways, I paid two bucks and got my three dollar extra care buck. Um, I grabbed the CVS liners, dollar nineteen, getting a dollar nineteen back. Then I grabbed the Cliff Bar for. To a $2.59, I had a free Cliff coupon. So basically how that spilled out um, was, there's everything, all my coupons, my ACBs and all that. I paid 62 cents out of pocket um, and I basically spent net cost because I used a $3 extra back. It would have been $3.19 and I got back four, making it a little money maker. And so I did a second transaction and I originally, this actually couldn't have worked out more perfect. What did I do with the, the Alka-Seltzer stuff? Maybe, he, did he put it in here? Yes, he shoved it down here. Um, these Alka-Seltzer gums, they're three for a dollar this week and you get a dollar extra back back when you buy three, making three of them free. And then my mom was with me um, today because she wants to go to Walmart. Um, so she was there and I wanted to actually get her a bag for Christmas. and. She didn't know that. She was just there looking. It was like, oh, this is a really nice bag. It was only 25 bucks um, for this huge bag. And so I was like, well, you're here, but we're just gonna buy it anyway, because I said that on the vlog on Wednesday. Sometimes it's better to know exactly what the person wants. I am clueless about picking out purses or anything. So she knew exactly what she wanted. So just went ahead and bought it today and we'll save it back for Christmas. Um, have a gift idea to go along with that. that hopefully will still be a surprise. So yes, um, that's done now. We are going to run a couple errands. I am gonna go to Rite Aid, load up at Rite Aid, I'm so excited. But yes, DVS was a good sign, really good sign. All right, so I spent my bonus cash out at Rite Aid. I had an awesome, awesome haul. I only have five bucks left in bonus cash, but that's all right. I didn't wanna roll $60. Five is plenty for as little as I come here, but I got some really good stuff and I'll get back money on Ibotta too. Just made it a really awesome time. So awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, so heading on into Walmart. Really not that busy. More people buying up toilet paper, paper towels. This is weird because the drugstores had plenty of this kind of stuff, but Walmart is like wiped clean. I don't even know if they have tissues, really. This is, oh, it looks like they have some angel soft, but they hardly have anything. I don't know why everybody just goes for this stuff as soon as they get scared. It's like, does it make you feel better to buy up toilet paper? I, I don't understand it. It's really weird. There are Black Friday things, but it just doesn't seem like, I don't know. It's just not like how it used to be. People clearly have been buying up stuff, but I don't know. Still just not the same. A lot of you guys ask what printer I recommend, and this is the one I got last year, this Canon um, TS3322. 19 bucks right now, phenomenal printer. This is a really good printer. It's lasted me forever. The ink lasts forever, really good. Definitely a different feeling this year for Black Friday than other years because obviously there's not as many deals that have spread it out or whatever. And I don't know, it just feels different. It's not as exciting as other years have been, but 
I see not one Black Friday deal that I want. I just got my couponing stuff. In fact, it looks like the only new Black Friday deals is like socks and stuff like that. Not really anything big. It's kind of weird. Looks like a fire or something went down with some adult diapers. It's kind of weird. Everybody just threw them all over the floor. It's really creepy. All right, so home now, did the haul video, and I lined everything out for the thumbnail. The stuff, the freezer stuff's already put it back away, but man, guys, this was a haul in the books. Legit $2.10. I think it was exactly what it was for all of this stuff. Man, you cannot go wrong. Of course, all the breakdowns are in the haul video. The haul video is up, but I'm just so happy with it. I think I'm done Black Friday shopping now. I don't think there's anything else left to do. It was such a great, great time out couponing. Getting the deals. So much fun. Loved it. And at first thought it was not going to be a very good Black Friday. Oh, the only downfall, I realized, I accidentally grabbed women's slippers instead of men's. I, I always thought the CVS ones were um, not gender specific, but I don't know. Maybe I can go there and exchange them or something um, and get the men's ones. But yeah, that is what happened. And I'm really happy with my haul. So, so, so happy with it. Been an awesome time couponing. I did get some ice cream. <laughs> Um, on the way back from the stores, I'll put a picture of it up here. It's from Wits. It's a local ice cream place. I did really, really good stuff. I loved it. Um, now what I'm doing is I'm laying the video export. I'm gonna upload the haul, and I'm gonna then I'm gonna. I have no way I'm gonna putting all this stuff away tonight. That's for tomorrow. Um, but then I gotta write a paper tonight. Um, a case study is what we call them. It's for my accounting class. We basically take an ethics case and we write our thoughts about it or whatever. So I'm going to try to get that done tonight because I got a lot of work to do this weekend too for YouTube and everything. So I'd like to get school knocked out today. So yeah, it's kind of what's on the agenda now. I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. All right. It is like 936 now. I just got done with that big paper. I also like went through and answered comments did the savings tracker thing that I've been doing all year. Um, did a lot of just busy work. So I'm glad I got all that stuff done. Um, now I'm just gonna take it easy, watch some TV, relax the rest of the night before I go to bed. Tomorrow, um, I am planning on staying at home. I think I have to run out and get the Kroger ad at some point, but like no shopping, no nothing. I'm just getting stuff done at home tomorrow, um, which is kind of nice. I've been like literally running around the last three days. I'm just like ready for a breather i'm ready for a breather so yeah that is all for the vlog i hope you guys enjoyed this go watch those haul videos um or the haul video and the kroger deals video i actually did two videos today um i'm glad i got both of those up so you guys could see the haul earlier i'm so so happy with how that haul turned out it was really an awesome awesome black friday it was different it was totally different because I, I'm making a habit this year to put every, like, I don't know if you guys know some of the end cards. It says last year's vlog. So we can see, oh, here's what I was doing last year at this time. Totally crazy how much my life has changed in a year. But last Black Friday, I went to Walmart, the mall, like Walmart, like five times. The mall, Kohl's, Sam's Club, all these stores, crazy Black Friday shopping. And this year, I don't know, I know a lot of people who did still go out, but to me, it just didn't seem like it was the same as usual because they, like, split up the sales and stuff this year, so there wasn't that much, um, like usual. And I just feel like the deals are going to be just as good in December this year, which is why I'm planning on doing it next week. I don't know. So, it just was a different kind of Black Friday, but I am thankful the drugstores still had deals for me to do. That's my Thanksgiving tradition. I love it. I loved getting to go out and do all this stuff at the drugstores. And it was just a great time. So, yeah, that's all I got for today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. And thank you so, so, so much for watching.